Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Muhammad Ahmad Shahir bin Jamal Abana From BEI 1 slash 1 Okay, the electric current produces a magnetic field This magnetic field can be visualized as a pattern of the circular wire Circular field lies surrounding a wire Okay, then one way to explore the direction of the magnetic field is with a compass As shown by a long straight current carrying wire in Okay, then all props can determine the magnetic magnitude of the field Okay, thank you Hello, my name is Muhammad Zahir bin Zainal Abidin and I'm from section 11. Okay, I will continue uh, another version of the right hand rule emerged from this exploration and is valid for any current segment. Point the thumb in the direction of the current and the fingers curve in the direction of the magnetic field looks created by it. Okay, for example, we use right hand rule, right? Okay, when the wire carries a strong current, the compass needle detect in a direction tangent to the circle which is the direction of the magnetic field created by the current for example we use the hand rule uh, upward is current and the circular is um, the direction of circular is magnetic field right An electric motor converts electrical energy into mechanical energy. A DC motor uses direct current electricity that flows continuously in only one direction around a circuit. A DC motor consists of an armature that rotates within a magnetic field. The armature has a coil of wire wrapped around an iron core. A source of electricity is connected to brushes which make contact with the commutator on the armature. The commutator is a kind of switch that changes the direction of current flow in the coil as it turns. The electric current flows from the source to the motor and back to the source in one direction. The current carrying wires in the coil experience forces in the presence of the magnetic field. When current is flowing through the coil in the direction shown, the segment of wire near the south magnetic pole is pushed downward by the magnet. The segment near the north magnetic pole is pushed upward. In this way, the magnet causes the armature to turn. After each half turn, the commutator reverses the current. Forces on the coil reverse and the turn is complete. The cycle repeats, making the movement continuous. Devices attached to the rotating armature shaft, such as pulleys and gears, can be used to perform any number of useful tasks.